Hey to my lovely, wonderful viewers, welcome back to another audit. Now, to, in today's audit, I thought I would actually try something new and different that I don't believe has been done before. I could be wrong, but I don't think has been done be before on any of these audit channels, not that I've seen anyway. And let's just say I am going to go against the status quo today and even though I know I am perfectly legal to film people in public as it's called public photography a lot of you may be aware of it there are some people who still don't get public photography and talking to a lot of people over the last few days or so about public photography there are some people who let's say i understand where they're coming from however they're a little bit maybe stuck in their ways and they don't believe in public photography so i thought what i may do today is i'm going to go out and about i'm in the beautiful town or village as you like called Clitheroe and I'm going to go around Clitheroe asking the beautiful people of Clitheroe if they don't mind being filmed and basically see what kind of reaction I get. Like I said I know I'm legally allowed to film anybody without their permission in public however i am going to ask people's permission and see if i can rock up some sort of interesting conversation and see what the good people have to say and see if i get talking to any interesting people along the way so enjoy and let's see what happens as you can see here i have my trusted psychic ozzy with me so I'm sure he will help me out along the way today and I'm sure we'll bring in some attention won't you Ozzy yeah? If anything he'll break the ice from it with these lovely people. Hey, yeah. Excuse me, guys. Do you mind if I ask you a few questions? No, that's fine. Can I ask you permission if it's okay if I film you? Yeah. Yeah, hello. you sure? Hello, say hello, everybody. So, this is actually why I'm asking you these questions. You are all aware of public photography, right? You know what it is. And you know that out in public you don't need to ask people's permission even though I've politely just asked you you can actually legally film someone without asking their permission are you aware of that yes. oh that's good then that's good because um, I uh, I have a YouTube channel which I'll give you my card right here and um, yeah um, so basically I obviously like I say I go out and I do audit switch or a little bit on the controversial side shall we say you know filming people out in public yeah exactly yes yeah, so you know you know exactly and um, we get some 
as you can imagine, very interesting, controversial, you know, people are against it, people say, no, you shouldn't film me without my permission. What What do you say about that? People who film the police do it to get a rise out of them. Why do you say that? Because it's, you've done it more than once, yeah. and you get the same response every time. You should expect the response that you get when you film the police without that permission. It's rude. People don't like it. Even though legally you're allowed to do it, yeah. you have to understand that it's rude and it annoys people. And you don't. No, of course, and I completely understand that. However, for, on our defence, we actually don't do it for that reason, as I've just asked your permission. Right. You know what I mean? Uh, yeah. You ask the police's permission when you film that. Yeah, but do, you, do they ask your permission when they film you? Well, exactly, exactly. It's, do you know what I mean? It works both ways. And not just that, but when we go anywhere into a local town centre, we are being filmed on CCTV cameras, aren't we? All the time. People forget that and they don't realise, do they, that, you know, we're being filmed all the time. They don't ask our permissions. Good question that I got almost instantly when we started to speak. Sorry, it's Jim. Hi, hi. I'm Kat, by the way. Hello, hi. everyone. Hi, <laughs> Um, the first question I had, had, they jumped up straight away, Matt was actually quicker to voice it, um, which I don't believe you've gotten to the actual the reasoning behind it, the point, as it were, why, why you do what you do. Well, for, for me, I can't speak for all auditors, obviously it's to make people aware that public photography is allowed and it's not illegal, and then the other one is transparency, to make sure that the police are basically doing the what they're supposed to be, what we're peeing, yeah, holding them accountable, because there's a lot of photographers who've been arrested just for doing this and yeah. just stood outside a police station and taking pictures. So it's, it is, it's very interesting on both sides, do you know what I mean, to see what people think, what people yeah. say, and I understand if people are against it, you know what I mean, I can completely understand it from both sides, but, you know, people need to be aware that, you know, it is allowed and we are allowed to do this and in my opinion I'd suggest everybody gets the camera and goes out and films everything because you never know what you're going to come across do you and also for me it's kind of like an online diary if you like for in years to come we can look back at put his beads <laughs> pardon put his beads on your camera oh yeah 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 my bracelet um, no, it's just something for anxiety and say, positivity. So, positivity then, an interesting yeah. question in that in certain, uh, for a certain lens, um, things can be viewed as black and white. Now recently I have had actually, actually had five disagreements with people and a lot of that with my line of work was because where I work was quite, for a bigger company, yet yeah, quite a private place. Yeah. And what was recorded and what was true were often made out to be the same thing and it's not the case because in a place like that um, you can document more or less anything now i started after a few years i started to wear quite thin with that cat you see and i'm not religious though i do find certain buddhist practices are quite helpful something yeah. called if i may the eight rites which is part of the eightfold path and okay. that begins with I can't remember more than three things in a row, <laughs> but basically it's something like right frame of mind, right thinking, right speech, right action, there's four more to stick in there. Yeah. Uh, now I became very uncomfortable with the apparent discrepancies between what we were being told and what we were actually doing. And with my mental health, the way it is, I can't figure out the difference. You get other, yeah, other yeah, colleagues yeah. who kind of instinctively go, ah, oh, we can bend the rules here. Yeah. Now, Black, in a black and white way, I would kind of go, actually, I'm going to follow the rules and um, kind of trust that overall things are all right. Now, you gather I'm a bit of a rambler and I am making a point now. I saw my, I'm a rambler too, so you're okay. You're not a practitioner, Kat, <laughs> though I would argue that you're wearing that, so you have some inclination of what it means to do the right thing. Is that behind your work then? No, In no, it's just way, you... something I chose to buy and chose to wear to, like I say, help me along the track of positivity. What, you, what you're doing though, um, positivity will be, um, positivity will be a product of what you're doing. Though there is presumably yeah. an element of justice. Well, to be honest with you, since I wore this and I started this channel. Let's just say things have gone very positive for me, I'm not going to lie. Do you mind if we just leave it on that note then, Kat? Yeah, no, yeah. that's, yeah, thank, thank you. I appreciate you talking to me, I really do. So, yeah, have a nice day, and everyone, yeah, thank you. Christmas. Yeah, you too, Merry Christmas, yeah. everyone. Bye-bye. Come on, thank way. you. See you later. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>
first positive interaction, Ozzy. Very first positive interaction. We have a fellow photographer here. <laughs> Hello, how are you? How are you? <laughs> you okay? <laughs> can I talk to you since as you are filming? Yeah. Um, can I ask your permission if I can film you? You can. You can. So I'm taking doing what you're doing there. You understand what public photography is, do you? I do. You do. So you know quite well that um, you don't need people's permission to take the pictures out in public. I do. You do. That's good. That's good. That's all I wanted to know. I'll give you my card and you can check me out. There you I'm go. New to, I'm new to this game. I've only got two. <laughs> nice setup you've got there. Little go for it. It's very interesting. I've never been here before, but uh, I've only. It's lovely, well, isn't it? I've got two videos up on YouTube, but I'm new at this game. Oh, but... well, if you comment on my video, I'll shout you out later. So, yeah, there you go. Good Thank luck. You Thank you. See you later. There are some who, we get called antagonizers. So, we'll get called, we're going up to someone and we're antagonizing them on purpose. There are some, I'm not going to lie, there are some that do that. You know what I mean? They'll purposely get a. Yeah, oh, well, that's it. That's my point. There's good and bad when it comes to anything. Yeah. It's a beautiful lassie dog. He's gorgeous. Hello. <laughs> I love lassie dogs. They're so cute. Can I ask you a question? Can I ask your permission if it's okay to film you? Film me? Doing what? <laughs> um, well, to be honest with you, this is why I ask because um, I'm trying to just ask these lovely people that walk past me here. It, um, I'm kind of bringing awareness to people that out in public, um, public, you know, do you know anything about public photography? Mm, not really. No. So when you're out in public, such as we are now, that we don't actually illegally need to ask someone's permission if we can film them. I mean, it's obviously, as you can tell, very polite to do it. But um, if you're out in public and you see someone filming, such as myself, yeah. that we don't need permission to film you yeah, i know it might seem very strange and very odd but um i'm just trying to bring awareness to public photography and yeah. what I, you know what you maybe your thoughts are on that um, I, I, think it, I, think it, I don't think it matters in in some cases i mean these days we're filmed by cctv exactly the, exactly that's um, the that's the difference yeah it, you know because you never know where it's going or why and certainly if it was children i think that's a different story. it is a different um, story that yeah it's a very touchy subject it's children you know public filming where people just wander around yeah yeah that's that's for, thank you for, please can i uh, talk to you for a minute yeah, yeah. Uh, can i ask you permission if i can film you yeah, is that fine? Well, I was just about to say um, that I'm trying to bring awareness to public photography and if you know anything about it. Uh, not a great lot. No. Yeah. So this is what I mean. So obviously I've respectfully just asked your permission, but basically I'm trying to bring awareness to people that when we're out in public, such as where we are now, that legally we can film anybody without asking their permission if we want to. I know it may come across as very odd, very strange, but um, yeah, but that's basically what I'm doing here. I'm just, I am respectfully going up to people and asking, but what I'm saying is legally I could just stand here and film, say like I'm filming the castle and you walk past me, I wouldn't have to ask your permission and that would be perfectly fine. What, what's your thoughts on that? Well, it, it, there has been quite a lot about it, aren't there? Yeah, recently? yeah. And some people would react quite badly to it. That's um, it, yeah. If you've got something to hide. Exactly, it. yeah, that's it. If you've got something, if you've got nothing to hide, you, you've got, no, you know, you don't, you wouldn't mind. Whereas some, like you say, a lot of people <laughs> get uh, tangled up there. A lot of people do have um, something to hide and they, yeah, like, like you said, they react badly when they're being filmed and it's like, what's going on there? Why is it you don't want to be filmed so much? Yeah. You know what I mean? I understand some people may be camera shy yeah. and they don't want to be filmed. That's perfectly fine. And as I say, if you're respectful to me and you say, you know, please don't film me, I don't want to be on camera, 
that's showing respect whereas if you come up and attack me and approach me you're the one who's in the wrong not the person doing the filming does that make sense yeah yeah, yeah. Do you like taking like just landscape uh, everything i go yeah. out and i film every, as you might see later yeah. if you look at that you've got a particular interest in people uh, everything. everything everything yeah so but anyway thank you very thank much you. for talking thank to me guys. thank you see you, see you later thank you have a good day have a good christmas see ya he's gorgeous he's gorgeous uh in a local pet shop yeah yeah um actually whilst you're here do you mind if i ask you a few questions no. Uh, do you mind if I ask your permission if I can film yeah? Uh, Are you okay? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, actually, this is what I'm doing. I want to bring awareness to. Do you have it, um, any knowledge on public photography? Yeah. No. So, what public photography is, as you can see right here, we're out in public. And when you are out in public, legally, I don't actually have to ask your permission if I can film you. You know that. But obviously, I mean, as you can see, it's polite if you do. But um, I do have a YouTube channel. Um, and you can actually find out where I got Ozzy's caught on there as well, like from a pet shop. So, yeah. Um, but, yeah, this is that's what I do. And um, it's just basically going out and, make, you know, making more, filming more aware of people. So, yeah, yeah um, and you get you get cops being being annoying about what you can film and what you can not exactly. film. Exactly, I I do do auditing and I do go and film the police as well. Yeah. And as it's as you can imagine, it's a very controversial topic. Yeah. So, what's your thoughts on it then? Uh, well, I I do agree that if you're in, in public, you should be able to film whatever you can see. That's um, it. You may be witness of, of something that's not right. And then, Exactly. Any sort of or any sort of this is like what, as we up. like to say, the third eye. Yeah. It's a subjective yeah. camera, you know. Yeah. If it's something weird. happens, it's weird when you're in the, I'm like, in the other side of it. Yeah, <laughs> well, yeah. <laughs> that, a lot of people are camera shy, and there's nothing wrong with that. Yeah. However, some people they they just don't like being filmed at all, and they can become very aggressive towards yeah. the photographer. <laughs> Our dogs are having a whale of a time over there. <laughs> he just loves playing. He loves playing. But yeah, anyway, thank you very much for coming to you. You're very lovely. Uh, I hope you have a very good Christmas. You too, you <laughs> See you later. Uh, bye bye. <laughs> See you later. Come on, you. Come on. <laughs> Look at the size, it's beautiful! Oh my goodness! Oh, that's so cute! It's the, as it does too, as you can see. <laughs> he talks, he wants to play. <laughs> Look at him! Oh, I say, come here! I say, I say, I say, come here! Come here, don't be a bully! Oh, he's lovely. <laughs> I'd be scared if I were that size too. <laughs> See you later. Uh, come on, you. <laughs> So guys, look where we are now. If some of you aren't aware, this is Clitheroe Police Station and my good friend Matt had a very lovely interaction here with a couple of, shall we say, very, very gullible police officers. I will put the link to that video in the description down below but yeah I'm just going to do a quick audit on Clitheroe Police Station why I'm here. As you can see there are a few police cars parked out front of here and yeah that video made me chuckle the whole way through because let's just say the then police officers in that video were very very uneducated on the law to say they were police officers but go check that video out for yourselves and you'll find it 
very very funny I've just been watching you on YouTube. Oh, oh yeah. hi, yeah. So How are you? Much. What's your name? David. David, do you mind if I film you? No, no. no. no oh, no, it's no. nice to meet you. Are you subscribed? I think I am, yeah. You think you, th yeah. you, think you are? You I, I just thought it was funny when I was tempted to come down myself <laughs> and just to wind them up, you know. Did you see Matt's video? Yeah, yeah that's, that's obviously. Brilliant. Obviously, no. they they were clueless, weren't they? I was just doing my intro to it then, and no, yeah, sorry. yeah, no, it's all right. You're okay. Um, yeah, yeah. Oh no, I was just yeah, I'm coming down there to do the same thing, and yeah, yeah it's it, very very silly. I'm actually out today, you know, to see if people want to be filmed, and you yeah. know, obviously, as you know, we don't have to ask permission, but um, I'm I'm early, I'm politely asking to see what reaction I get. But I'll give you my card anyway since you come up and said hello. Oh, Thank you very much. Yeah, Thank no you. Problem. But yeah. yeah. Um, keep up the good work if uh, you're thinking of going out doing it yourself. I'm so, just, I'm walking down and just think, if there's anybody about, I'll, go, I'll get my camera out, pretend. <laughs> and, uh, See what happens. Them, you know, just, just, yeah, yeah just why not? Why not? I, this is what I encourage everybody to do, yeah. you know. This is what we're heading into now. Which everyone should go out with a camera and start yeah. filming. It so, so, yeah. Ridiculous. It was, it, yeah. it was, it was laughable, wasn't it? Yeah. And to say the police who should know the law, it was laughable. And then that's, that's it, that's it, yeah. that's There's it. That guy in Scotland, uh, uh, ca cas castle, the castle, that's the one. Yeah. Brilliant guy. He got done outside a horse stable, didn't he? And yeah. Oh my god, again, they, they're so frustrating, aren't they? Yeah. Very infuriating yeah. when they just. just... Like you think they're entitled to the information, but you're not. Exactly, you just go, exactly, you that's you, it. You know, unless you're breaking the law. Exactly, you know, that's it. When we're all we're doing is harmlessly taking pictures and then yeah. we get approached and like as if we're criminals or something. It's yeah. silly, isn't it's it? The camera's a weapon. It's yeah, it's exactly. Weapon. Mass destruction, this camera, mass destruction. <laughs> oh, thank you very much. You appreciate it. See you later. See you later. There you go, guys. So that was very interesting as I approached this place. He were coming up thinking he was going to do the very same thing, but I beat him to it. So I applaud that guy very much there for standing up for his rights. And obviously he saw the video and there you go. Uh, 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 just to back up what I was saying about them, silly police officers. You like that? You like that? He's waving at you. He's waving at you. like the camera more than the dog. <laughs> Look at all that juicy food, Ozzy. All that juicy food. Thank you. 
Oh, very festive. Oh, very festive. Look at you. <laughs> oh, you're so cute in your Christmas outfits. So cute. <laughs> oh. Excuse me, can I ask you a question? Sure. Yeah, do you mind if I get your permission to film you? I'm afraid I do quite a strange job, so... You do a... so you want your face le left out? No worries, I'll point it down. Um, what do you make of um, public photography? It's, it's nice. It, yeah, you, it you, you agree with it? It's nice to see it. It'd be nice if this place was a bit more clean. <laughs> it's, it's a lovely place, isn't it? It's a lovely it place, yeah. Um, so the reason why I approach you and ask you that is because if you are, uh, do you know anything about public photography? Not much. Not much. So legally, it's polite to ask somebody for yeah. the permission to film, but I legally don't have yeah. to. Yeah. So you're aware of that. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, since you've been very polite, I won't. I won't nice. use your face. Um, what job do you do? Do you mind uh, me asking? I, I work in the uh, military. Oh, do you now? Do you now? Actually, that's even different than if you work in the military because, yeah. as you'll be aware, that <laughs> public I service, I guess so. So what's your take on it then? Um, on public photography in general or...? Uh, yeah, yeah, on um, and being filmed as, I guess, you're a public servant, yes, would you say? Yes, I think the class is public servant. Yeah, it's, um, it, it's, it's one of them where, obviously, depending on the job role you do, the majority of public servants taking your photograph, I imagine, it's not going to be a big deal to them. Yeah. But if you're in a certain field where um, someone seeing your face could... Potentially put you in danger. Yeah. yeah. That, no, that, that's, fair that's enough, fair enough, fair enough, fair enough. So, there we have it, guys. Some very, very interactions, I may add. I would have possibly have liked to get a few more, but as you can tell... The heavens have opened up and it has started to absolutely bucket it down and me and Ozzy are getting a little bit cold and are ready for home. So I hope you've enjoyed today's video. Please like, share and subscribe and until the next time, bye!